So you're thinking of moving to Casper, Wyoming? Great, but you need to come visit first. I have had a lot of people coming to visit this beautiful city to see if they wanna live here. They always ask me what to do. So I thought we should make a list of things that are fun to do right here in Casper. Whether you're visiting to see if you'd like to make Casper your home or you've recently moved here, or even if you've been here for a while and need some new ideas, I've got your back. Hi, I'm Alicia Collins with the Alicia Collins Real Estate Team. I have told you all about what makes Wyoming wonderful, but we also need to talk about the things that are fun and amazing that you can do right here in Casper, Wyoming. Are you a supporter of small business? I am. I have so many favorite small locally owned businesses here in Casper. Some of them I've talked about before and I'm gonna talk about again. There is something about the mom and pop type shops, the young entrepreneur owned stores, the local neighborhood places, it feels different inside of those businesses, doesn't it? Almost a little bit like home, maybe. When you visit Casper or move to Casper, you should absolutely put visiting local small businesses on your list of to-dos. The Cadillac Cowgirl is a go-to for my shopping needs. This local hotspot carries clothing and footwear that can handle the crazy Wyoming weather as well as our culture and way of life. The owner, Callie, has made it a point to bring in jewelry made by other local moms from around Wyoming. She believes it is important that we support the families that are within our community. This store carries many accessories from handcrafted leather purses to fun felt hats, scarves, and wraps to statement necklaces. If you're looking for yourself, a friend, or family member, this store in downtown Casper is by far one of my favorites. A lot of my clothes have come from this store. Now, next door to the Cadillac Cowgirl, you'll find another locally owned favorite, the Floral Rhino. This store is full of perfect gifts for just about anyone in your life. From clothing to quirky gifts to jewelry, they really do have it all. And it would be almost impossible not to find the perfect gift for anyone on your list, including yourself. Local restaurants are another thing on my list of what to do when you visit Casper. And there are so many great options. Downtown, you can find a few of the local treasures. Eggington's, which I've mentioned before, is a staple of our local community. They serve breakfast and lunch, and they're owned by Casper Native and her husband. They do catering and tons of things for the community. And did I mention that their food is delicious? From the bocado, bacon and avocado omelet, to the French toast, burgers and sandwiches, and of course, the freshly squeezed orange juices and mimosa, and on-site brewed espresso, it is a place that's worth stopping. Yum. Another local favorite, for restaurants is my personal favorite stop, Wyoming Ale Works. They have 40 craft beers on tap, which means you're in for a real experience. Go ahead and pair that with freshly sourced ingredients and a chef-driven menu, and you have everything you need for a good time. They have for sure crafted a balance between the rugged local nature of Wyoming and a modern brew house. Whether you're looking for a quick stop for a beer and an app or a nice dinner with family and friends, Wyoming Ale Works will not disappoint. Beyond food, we also have a plethora of local breweries and they are always worth a stop when you visit Casper, Wyoming. This is a part of town that is growing quicker than you might be able to keep up. From Gruner Brothers Brewery, where they make statewide love beers, to a newly opened Bullhorn Brewing located right off Beverly Street. There is not a shortage of stops for the beer lovers visiting or living in Casper. I might have to do a whole video just on the breweries in town to cover them all. Okay, so maybe you don't plan your trips around food and drink like some of us do. <laughs> in that case, I still have you covered. How about something outside? Right here in Casper, just about 15 minutes from the downtown area, is Garden Creek Falls. A bit of an unexpected waterfall surprise in the eastern part of the state of Wyoming near the town of Casper. It featured a thin multi-tiered drop in the heart of Rotary Park, just to the southeast of town. This is a hike that leads right up to the base of the waterfall. And this hike is just about for everyone. The climb is doable for all skill levels and the view is worth it for all. You can wade in the water and enjoy the sounds of the falls behind you as you explore. There is even a bench for taking in the scenery at the top. And if you happen to be more of an avid hiker, Rotary Park includes the Bridal Trail, which is more of a workout with a ton of amazing views and scenery. There is something for everyone in this particular area. You simply cannot go wrong. If you've never been to Wyoming, you might not know how majestic and breathtaking a Wyoming sunset can be. 
it doesn't really matter what time of year it is, what the weather is doing, or what's going on around the town. The sunset is always in view and always looks like it was hand painted just for your enjoyment. You can drive up the mountain to Lookout Point to enjoy it, head down the pathway along the river, or even stop along any road throughout town, and you are almost always guaranteed to see something beautiful in the sky. There really are a ton of things to do when you visit Casper. I'm not kidding. The list could go on and on. Drop a comment below if you visited and tell me your favorite places. Casper Real Estate is really what I know best, but with that comes a deep love for the area that I call home. I love where I live, and I'd love for you to love where you live too. If you need any information about Casper or about Casper Real Estate, please reach out to me. We have time for you, and we love hearing from all of you in the comments and you calling us.